Hey everybody, this is a quick video in case you have a Neat Bar or Neat Bar Pro paired with a Neat Pad or just a standalone Neat Pad and you need to do a hard reset to the factory default settings on them. Now you're going to want to do this for one of two reasons basically. The first one is troubleshooting. If these devices are not connecting or not responding or if they keep disconnecting, if you're having audio or video issues, anything like that can very often be fixed with a hard reset um, to the factory default settings. Now you're going to need to set it up again and that's the second reason you might want to do this um, and that is if you want to get this set up in a new room, a new meeting room or something like that or for whatever reason you just want to get it back to the way it was when it was new coming out of the box we can go ahead and do that. Now if you've got the neat bar and the neat pad combo you've got to reset both of them. You can't just reset one. If you Obviously if you just have the neat pad or whatever um, then you don't need to, then you only have one thing to reset and you can still reset it. So um, all you need to do is you find the reset buttons on the back of each of them. So on this is the pad, you'll see it right next to where it plugs in here. There, the reset button is here. And this is the neat bar. If you have the neat bar pro, the button will be right about here. Um, this one, you can't actually see it here, but it's right here. It's because it's not on the flat part of the plugs. It's just facing down here. You're gonna plug it. So basically you're gonna here and here, you're gonna press those reset buttons um, for about five seconds. And then once you do that, you'll, you'll notice that it'll turn off and then you'll see that the, it'll turn back on and the purple neat logo will show up on the screen um, of the pad and you're done. You can go ahead and set it up as a new device.